So third down continues to be a problem for Seattle. Aaron Donald now. Oh, here's a block. Blocked off the foot of Dixon, and Dixon now kicks it. Well, that's coming back. That's coming back as this goes down near the 10. But that's two kicks for the price of one. And I'm thankful Mike Pereira is here with us in Seattle. Mike's thankful he's here, too. He gets to chime in. You actually see everything once in a while you haven't seen in a very long time and this is one now you can advance the ball once it's been blocked you can pick it up behind the line of scrimmage and you can advance it but uh, no you can't kick it again. Well just picking it up and running with it how much fun is in that Mike. <laughs> yeah. Well that I mean, is <laughs> that is true. That's when you got these big guys chasing you. Jameer Jones is the one that got through. And that wasn't even close. I mean, he he was there waiting for that. And then, by the way, the ball went 68 yards on kick number two, but it's not going to count. <laughs> well, Dixon's laughing a little bit himself. He's, he's well, these officials, by the way, Mike, are trying to figure out where the heck the ball goes. Inside the 20. There is no foul for illegally kicking the ball. The punter's heel was on the line of scrimmage at the time that he kicked the ball. It'll be Los Angeles' ball, first and ten, at the dead ball spot. Well, I mean, that's something we got to look at because there was an addition in the rule book this year, an editorial change that said you can't kick the ball twice, even from behind the line of scrimmage. It creates a ten-yard penalty, so that's something we're going to have to look into. Well, we'll check back in with you. I mean, this is an incredible play by Dixon. The blocking breaks down. Jones gets through and Dixon chases it down starts to run and then says I'm just going to kick it and for now there's no penalty.